Every country I've gone to while traveling, I've searched for the best and most unique vending machines. So today, after two years of straight travel from Tokyo to Paris, I'll be making a list of the cool, delicious, and straight out bizarre top 10 vending machines from around the world. Hello everyone, and welcome to one of the more surprising vending machine hotspots of the world. Amsterdam. See here in Amsterdam and actually all around the Netherlands there's an incredible amount of burger and also fast food vending machines. Okay, so welcome to the largest chain of these fast food vending machines, Fabo. Now this type of vending machine is actually one of the oldest types of vending machines called the Automat, which originally gained popularity in New York City, but now has since become an incredibly popular and quite normal thing here in the Netherlands. And let me tell you, even though this is a vending machine restaurant, there's a huge amount of variety here. Anything from a cheeseburger, to the Dutch specialty, the croquette with multiple different flavors, to chicken sandwiches, to fried sandwiches, I don't even know the name to. So I think it's time to get one of everything. So you can just pay with Apple Pay. You're right, and then you choose this. Oh, that's so cool. Wow, Fingers that's so over. cool. It's hot. It's hot? Yeah. Oh my God, so cool. Okay. It is insane that you can get this many different options from a vending machine. All in all though, this does not look like a vending machine meal. Hot, delicious, cultural discovery. This is my jam right here. Now, everyone knows that Tokyo is the self-proclaimed king of vending machines. But what most people don't know is that some of the most unknown and best are in the Haneda Airport. All right, so welcome everybody to the Haneda International Terminal, also known as Heaven on Earth for vending machines. And I'm incredibly hungry, so I'm gonna go to not only one, not two, but a restaurant vending machine area. So welcome everybody to the vending machine restaurant, full of a coffee and matcha machine, a hot foods machine, a family mart vending machine, an ice cream one, and then different drinks. <laughs> so many choices. But to get us started off, I mean, I have to go with the hot foods machine. So it looks like they have like some sort of fried rice slash possibly chicken. Well, octopus balls, but I tried those last time. Rice and then french fries. I think I'm going to have to try the thing that I just I don't know very well. So I'm going to go with the fried chicken or rice or whatever that one is. So now it just deposited in here and there's like a timer there warming it up. Ooh, three, two, one. Oh, let's check out what this is. Whew. It always just surprised me how hot they are. Oh my God, that's so hot. All right, so let's see how these are looking. Okay, so it's not fried chicken, it's rice. Okay, this is officially like feeling completely different than an airport. This seems like a bad of freaking like traditional shrine area. Oh my gosh, boy. Look at this. Unbelievable. So cool. So this is called an Emma vending machine and they're pretty they're pretty common at like different temples and shrines around Japan and also at the Haneda airport. <laughs> so how it works is you get a tablet here, you write a message or you write a wish on it and then you hang it over here with all the other tablets and then supposedly it's good luck and it's supposed to come true. But I mean, real talk, this is so freaking beautiful. Like what other airport in the world can you experience a tradition at through a vending machine? Let's see. So cool. Goodbye, wish. I hope you come true. Now, although everyone says Tokyo has the best vending machines in the world, and believe me, we'll be back there later in the video, arguably the biggest contender with Tokyo with the variety and also sheer uniqueness of vending machines is Singapore. So this vending machine is called Boon Lei Power Nasi Lama. And inside this vending machine, you have anything from white rice with squid cooked in chili paste to steamed white rice with fried chicken to Nasi Lama fried chicken wing. Oh my gosh, I wasn't expecting there to be this many choices. So I've never had fish before from a vending machine, so I think I'm gonna go with that. Okay. All right. Okay. 
and then you get it there. So then there's heating instructions on the side of the package here that gives you a specific number to press on the microwave. Hello, vending machine meal. Dang, this looks unreal. So first impressions of these two meals, just opening them up. I'm absolutely blown away. Like where have you ever seen real fish in a warm up vending machine? Also super impressed with the fry on that egg. It's almost a little bit scary looking at this egg because it seems like they just did this. Now, although Singapore had an array of hilarious incredible, lavish, and just straight out ridiculously awesome vending machine. They also have a vending machine that I can still not believe is a thing. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the car vending machine. I don't wanna make them think I'm gonna buy a car, but let's see if they'll let me bring down one of the luxury vehicles. Hello. It's a car vending machine? <laughs> how does it, uh, how does it work? Uh, how does it work? Oh, no. where are you from? Uh, New York. New York. And what kind of cars are up in the vending machine? Will I show you one? <laughs> My right is, um... Uh, You're so nice. Oh, like wow. Car, you just take a... So cool, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. It goes all the way up to yeah, the car. all the way up to get a car down. Wow, okay. On down. Yeah. For viewing. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh, that is officially the coolest thing I have ever seen. Oh my gosh. Woo! That it spins around too. Yeah. Wow, you guys are not playing around here. Now, after Singapore, I felt this sudden inspiration to explore more vending machines. Maybe they weren't just for Tokyo. Maybe there was hidden vending machines everywhere. So that led me straight to Taiwan. After exploring Taipei for a few days, there's been many occasions when I've randomly come across vending machines completely unique to Taiwan. Coconut vending machine. Never did I ever think I would be seeing a coconut in a vending machine. This is insane. Yeah, this works. Yeah. So it's getting my coconut right there on the conveyor belt, drilling the coconut there. Oh my gosh, it's like a, they're actually drilling like a hole in that. So cool. So the only way you can describe this challenge is it makes me feel like like I'm living one of my childhood dreams. So then I was like, what would I eat if I was a little kid again? And then I came across something that blew even my dreams out of the water. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the cake vending machine. I can't believe this is an actual thing. Okay, so let's see how this works here. English purchase. All right, so they sell a Yannick cream roll cake, a mango cream fruit jelly cake, and a chestnut cream roll cake. I think I have to go with the mango cream. Oh, this is so freaking awesome. So there's a video camera inside the vending machine, and it shows it getting the cake right there. <laughs> I wonder how big this cake actually is. Oh, and there it is. Holy crap. Oh, it's like a little freezer too. That is freaking massive. Oh my gosh. I didn't think I was actually gonna get like an entire cake here. Like I truly don't know where to even start with this. Like there's a knife here and I guess I'm gonna cut it into pieces. I feel like I want to offer a piece to someone, but I feel like that would just be weird. Like sitting on the stairs here in the subway station, like, hey, do you want a piece of cake? <laughs> now, although the cake vending machine was truly awesome, there's no denying the dominance of Japanese vending machines. So although we've already explored the best in the airport, now we go to the city. For the last hour and a half, I've been searching just relentlessly all over the internet to try to almost like take this dinner to the next level. Find somewhere that's something that you can only find in Japan. And if my Google Translate Chrome extension is correct, I, I think I found something. This one here, this is actually connected to a restaurant. You see, every afternoon, this restaurant here makes anything from like burgers to, I think that's a hot dog, to egg sandwiches and it's all homemade from this you know, tiny little shop. I don't know, I think I have to get all of them. 
don't even know if like this vending machine is even working. Like I just plopped the coin in there, but it didn't even really go into anything. So, oh, that's so cool. One dollar something. One hundred. I have a freaking feast waiting for me here from this homemade vending machine. The first thing is kind of like a chicken fried patty. The next sandwich is also a fried sandwich, but it looks to be more of a traditional fry. The third sandwich is probably the coolest one of the cheeseburger. As a hamburger lover, I've never seen a hamburger come out of a vending machine before, so that's... That's kind of next level. Also, the fourth thing is kind of a sandwich that looks almost like a brioche, but the ones that really get me are the three sandwiches here. Hot food, homemade food from a vending machine, that's pretty epic. But how about something that literally, I'm, I'm pretty sure like nobody has ever heard of something coming from a vending machine like it. And if you're hours of searching in Japanese, I don't necessarily know what is inside this vending machine that we're going to, more so that it's just called the mysterious vending machine. So basically what I've gathered from this vending machine online, again, this was written in Japanese, but basically you have all of these different things in here. So you have like a digital camera, you have a selfie stick, you have razors, you have iPhones, you have Beats, you have Nintendo DS, you have all of these things. You insert a thousand yen in and you can get one of them or you can get kind of like a, like a crap piece. So... Let's insert the thousand, and I don't know, let's see what we get here. This kind of feels like gambling to me, almost. <laughs> All right. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by his toe. If he hollered, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Oh, man. I'm like, I'm nervous to see what we got here. So it comes in like this little white package here. I feel like I'm almost like opening up a present on Christmas here. Let's see what we got here. The fact that I have no idea what's going to be inside is quite exhilarating, actually. Just from that, it's an entertainment. All right, let's see what's inside. All right, it looks like I got some sort of, like, wallet or something. And number one, my favorite vending machine in the world is, of course, the pizza vending machine. Now, although being incredibly good in Singapore and Tokyo, the real king of the pizza vending machine lies in the unexpected place of France. Having incredibly innovative pizzas of anything from the kebab pizza to the cheesy raclette to many other unforgettable and delicious options. Anyway guys, comment below your favorite vending machine and I'll see you for a big new adventure 